Hello everyone. So today we are walking towards transmitter Liblice u Českého Brodu in its likely last two or three days of operation. Right now the transmitter is broadcasting country radio. It's 20 kilowatts and they announced that at the end of March they cannot continue because the cables that hold the antennas in their place are no longer certified and there are no money for the replacement so it's likely that the whole antenna system will have to be demolished which is a shame because uh, the towers are in what looks to be great condition uh, compared to some others and also they are 355 meters tall, which is the tallest structure in Czech Republic. They have the tallest elevators in Czech Republic and they are also very likely the tallest radio masts used for broadcasting on the AM medium wave band. So right now we are walking under the signal transmission line, cage line and here is the small building that splits the signal between the two towers right there. Here's the look at the transmission line again. Down there is the transmitter itself. Formerly there were two 750 kilowatt Tesla units. Uh, nowadays uh, there is just one single 20 kilowatt tram transmitter broadcasting on 639 kilohertz country radio probably the last three days let's walk around the whole facility So this is a look from another side, beautiful view. The towers are unfortunately too tall to show simply when you are this close, so you have to enjoy a view from further away. Take a closer look. So we are next to the first tower or I don't know maybe to the second tower I'm not sure but this is mm, likely the closest you can get without breaking any rules Luckily it's not windy today, last time I was here it was super windy and you couldn't really hear anything other than wind, but today we have really nice weather so ideal time to take a walk like this. So now towards the second tower. Here are the anchor cables that would need to be replaced in order for these two towers to stay up but unfortunately there is likely no one that is willing to pay that kind of money so there is very little hope that this will continue to stand for much longer but we'll see Someone broke one of the gates, so 
we can take a closer look at how the wires are fixated to the ground. There are more that way. As you can see, it's quite sturdy construction. Here's another broken gate. So let's go here as well. There are two wires coming from this one. Probably because we are closer to the antennas. They seem in pretty good condition, so I would expect if nobody would touch this, then most likely it would stand just fine for another 20, maybe more years, but you never know what may happen, so nobody will take that risk, likely. Here we are, another section. This is the other tower, first or second, depending on where you start. Playing for Charlie and Ringo Star and Robbie Roberts are going to go ahead and right. The right will be in the middle. In the first half of the hour, Kukátko and Pozvánka on the concert. In the second half of the hour, the Pozvánky are one to the weekend and one to the evening broadcast of Country Radio. Good listening, whatever you want. 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 You can see the shade of the tower and the second one as well. Down there you can see the elevator. It's gas or diesel powered, I'm not sure, but it goes up. 350 meters, so it's the tallest elevator in Czech Republic and there's another one in the second tower they are made by some Swedish company, I'm not sure the name
So the elevator is right there and they say that the ride up takes around 45 minutes so uh, the technician uh, who serviced the upper parts uh, can read a book or something on the way up probably nothing else because uh, it's supposedly very loud when you go up so but it must be an interesting experience by the way the towers were built in 1976 sound distortion is due to the proximity to the transmitter so I have added my own to the pile of farewell radios Máme hlášenou další nehodu ve směru Praha Hradec Králové a to u odbočky na Bohdanec dokonce čtyři auta a brzdí se prudce do kolony, která rychle narůstá. Na Pražském okruhu na D0 od D7, kde jední se jsou dlouhé kolony, které začínají už od D6. V důsledku toho jsou kolony i na D5 od 7. km až k nájezdu na D0 a pokračují až za odbočku na Brandov. Důvodem je nehoda u odbočky na Ořech. A ještě 35. Tradičně kolony na průjezdu Vysokým mítem a Litomyšlí a na opačném konci na průjezdu Libersem. Hodně se v tunelu jezdí pouze jedním kruhem oběma směry. Další doprava za hodinu. Ostrou viditelnost s optikou na cesty přeje Barťák nejen do přírody. Expert na dalekohledy.cz Váš poradce na dalekohledy. Expert na dalekohledy.cz Jsem Blue. Miluji, když s námi objevujete nová místa u moře. Třeba v Albánii, v Jadranském klenotu a v mnoha dalších oblíbených destinacích k tomu. Ty největší slevy a výhody právě teď. Rezervujte si letní first minute dovolenou ještě dnes. Blue Style. Od čtvrtka v Lidlu najdete krutí prsa v ceně 169,90 za 1 kg. Avokádo, jeden kus za 19,90. Lidl, A vepřové maso ve sklenici různé druhy 300 gramů za 39,90. Lidl, Lidl, správná volba. Jestli máte pocit, že vám ta vaše kára žere jako nákladňák a že motor nějak netáhne, pak volejte 606 a 600 liček. Je to k nám do DPF. Problém je určitě ve filtru pevných částic. Filtr na počkání vyčistíme, obsah ekologicky zlikvidujeme a dáme vám rok nebo 100 000 km za ruku. Cenu a vše ostatní najdete na DPF.cz Festival Country Fontana 2025 Zveme vás k návštěvě našich festivalů v Praze, Plzni, Brně a Ostravě Pražská Country Fontana Prokukne v pátek 6. června a sobotu 
7. června na Štvanici, Plzeňská v sobotu 14. června ve Chojkových Lomech, Brněnská v pátek 13. června a sobotu 14. června v areálu bývalého pivovaru Řečkovice a Ostravská v sobotu 21. června v Loděnici v Dějilově. Veškeré informace o festivalech a předprodejích na www.countryradio.cz Generálním partnerem jsou Alfa křížovky. Kdo? Kdože? Cože? Alfa křížovky. Ty s duhou a stákem. Vždy skvělé, vždy zajímavé, každý měsíc nové. Alfa křížovky jsou nej, na fontáně je potkej. Ticho je ubíjející. Nejbližší vysílač Country Rádia je na 500 mil daleko a mé uši lačné hudby zejí prázdnotou. No, smutný příběh, ale s dobrým koncem. Někde tam vysoko, na modré obloze, se totiž pohupuje družice jménem Astra. Ta umí přenést vlny Country Rádia i daleko za hranice a bez poplatků. Country Radio i ze satelitu. Naladíte nás před 23 a půl. Více na www.countryradio.cz Chodím nám na dubcům a mám jim stráže pak se proplížím tmou přes tři nádvoří Podáš svůj klíč a propustíš pláže.